Hi everybody, welcome back to Mando Lessons. My name is Baron Collins Hill. In this week's lesson, we're going to do a simple to complex with the tune Jamie Allen. This is a great contra dance staple, uh, a tune that lots of people know all over the world, and uh, one of my favorite tunes of all time. It's a great one to get people dancing. It's in the key of G. The way these work, if you haven't done one before, is I'll start out by playing it as I taught it in the original Jamie Allen fiddle tune lesson, uh, where I just sort of play what I call the skeleton of the melody. And then as I play through it successively a couple times, I'm going to start adding some double stops, some other little ornaments that I'll talk through as I go along. And it's just a great way to uh, build out on the on your version of Jamie Allen if you haven't already. If you haven't learned the tune, definitely check out the original fiddle tune lesson and then come back here to spice it up a little bit. All my lessons are always free. Check them out at mandolessons.com or subscribe here on YouTube where there's new lessons every single week. Uh, as I said, they're always free, but it's greatly appreciated if you have uh, a way to donate. There's some options in the description. There's a PayPal link. Uh, you can join us over on Patreon where you get some access to lessons early, patron-only live streams, all sorts of fun stuff over there. Or maybe you just want to grab a shirt or a mug. Um, all the links are in the description. Not required, but greatly appreciated. With that, let's jump into today's lesson. All right, I'll start out by playing the melody as I taught it in the original Jamie Allen lesson and then start adding in some double stops, drone strings, slides, things like that. So one, two, three, four. B part. Add that G drone string. Big C chord. A lot of G and D drones. G chord. Big C chord. variation.
with the intensity. Get a groove going. Really use those G and D drone strings. Hopefully that gave you some ideas of things to work on with Jamie Allen. There's really a lot of great space to, you know, add in those G and D strings. Um, really work. I really like trying to kind of keep a constant kind of backbeat groove going in there with a dagger. Uh, yeah, my right hand has kind of got this funky groove while my left hand's trying to play the melody. That's something that I think is a little distinctive in this tune that you can try to add in. Um, I love the tune. Hope you enjoyed that and got something out of it. Subscribe if you haven't already because next week is going to be the Jamie Allen play along where we pass the tune back and forth. I'll play the melody, you play the chords. I'll play the chords, you play the melody. And it's a great way to kind of branch out and try some of the stuff you are working on and learning about in this lesson. Thanks so much for watching. Hope to see you again soon. Bye-bye.